feel a little congested. It's probably just allergies, but I better stay home for at least 10 days. <coughs> oh man, I feel like crap. Oh well, better suck it up and get to work. <coughs> That's definitely some post-nasal drip. I need to book a COVID test. <coughs> my nose won't stop running. Oh well, I better get off to my eight meetings in my tightly packed conference rooms because that is what is expected of me. Oh man, I'm dizzy. That's a symptom. Oh, diarrhea, that's a symptom. Fatigue, that's a symptom. I had a headache, that's a symptom too. Oh, nausea, honey, I'm 99% sure I have COVID. Oh wow, stay in bed. I'm gonna get you a rapid COVID test and some soup. Just rest. Oh. Oh man, I am dizzy. You are hungover. I'm fatigued and I have a headache? Hungover. Oh, my stomach's kind of- Hungover. Do I need to go to the doctor? No, you need to get your ass out of bed and go hang out with your kids. I'm sorry, I can't make it. A kid in my son's class sneezed. Honey, both of the kids have fevers. I'm getting the chills and have body aches, but it's okay. I have a work party in a tiny crowded bar. Gotta go. Honey, one of our children has a mild fever. Dear God. We have to cancel our adult trip. Obviously. We've been looking forward to it for 19 months. Canceled without hesitation. Yep. Okay, I got them some Motrin. If the sitter asks, we'll say they both have allergies. And if our sitter gets it? Not our problem. You're right. Vegas, baby. Girl! Honey, I was double masked, but the guy next to me coughed three times. I gotta go take a COVID test. <coughs> That cough kept me up all night. Oh well, we're late for the airport. Better go sit shoulder to shoulder with strangers for five hours, breathing in and out the same air, giving them my germs. It'll be great. So I coughed once, and now my boss won't even let me on the Zoom call. He realizes that I'm not contagious over Zoom, right? I did a full day of work and only puked at my desk twice. My boss was like, Kim, I wish more people had your dedication. Wow, I bet I'll get that raise now. All right, let's see. We should test you for COVID, uh, both strains of flu, strap, get you a chest x-ray just to be sure, and oh yeah, you may have walking pneumonia. <laughs> Tests? Nah, you're fine. Just a little viral bug going around. You're gonna be totally okay. Just get some liquids. See you next time. <coughs> oh, sweetie, you're feeling sick? Hold on. Okay, buddy, I'm here for you. Okay, I'll, I'll just wanna snuggle. I mean, but like six feet away, but I'm here. I am right here. But stay there. But I'm here. But but stay away. I'm here for you. Oh, sweetie, you're feeling sick? Come cuddle with mommy. That way I can expose myself to your germs. I will then go about my daily life exposing others to your germs as well. I'm praying the test says I have the flu or strep. Strep would be amazing. I have strep? Yes! That's amazing news, doctor. I have strep? That is the worst possible news. What an inconvenience to be home for 24 hours. Hi, this dinner is great. Thanks, you're doing dishes, right? Yeah, I guess just slide it under the door and then I'll bring it to the kitchen. Cool, is your nose still running? Yeah, a little bit. Okay, see you in a week. Okay, I guess. <coughs> hey, can I have a bite of that? Sure. Great. That's not gross at all. Mmm. Mmm. <coughs> oh, yeah. Guys, what were we thinking? I mean, so here's what happened. Kids, and we get normal sick, and it's not always COVID, right? But now when people are getting sick, we respect that, right? And we say, stay home, you're fine. Don't come to work, you're fine, just stay home. Because that's what you should do. I mean, COVID or otherwise, sick people should stay home. What were we thinking? I mean, with pride, I worked entire days with the flu. Like bragging, like, <laughs> I was so sick and I still went to work. It was what was expected of us. And I was like bragging to people how sick I was. What were we thinking, right? Okay, stay healthy. And if you're not healthy, stay home. By the way, real quick, Kim, you can attest to this. We did this, we had a false positive in our family and for two nights, this was how we did dinner. This is not written. This is merely a retelling of what happened in our lives when we thought one of us had COVID. We all went into separate rooms. Kim made dinner. We slid the dishes under the door and we did them in the kitchen. Right, Monty? Is that the kind of <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you like that, right? I mean, we made the most of it. It was super fun. It turned out, no, no, no COVID, no Rona. You, you didn't get to sleep next to your husband for a couple of days? That must have been really tough on you. So 
hard. Check out our merch. Check out our book. Check out our blog. It's at the whole Dernest family.